tweets for this game. Tweet at, at LOL Esports with the hashtag DIG win or the hashtag TDK win. We'll update the fan poll with your votes. Mid and trying to just have some pressure, some relevance. <laughs> Doesn't have to take over the game. But look at this Seraph. He's going in. He's a little too far. Like you said, right when he thinks he has that idea Kez. that he can take down Gamsu, oh. they go right for him. He gets bounced out by the last hit, actually, of a Zingy. And Kez does not get what he, he wants. Out of that ultimate, Shifter comes in with Shifting Sands. And a Zingy picks up first blood. Once again, has a hand in that for Dignitas. And now Shifter, he backs. So it's definitely going over to TDK uncontested. It's going to be a little bit of pain. 4.8 seconds for each one of those piercing arrows to come out. Very punishable. Blow your five. Look at this. Oh, Seraph. Oh. Uh, Here's the turn, turn away. W turn away. Away. Can I open my eyes yet? Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, you, okay. can, you can look, Rip. Okay, I, had it looks to, like, I had to save you from that. It looks like nothing happened. That's fine. I don't want to be in that lane anymore. Sorry, I have, I'm <laughs> very passionate about Rise right now. <laughs> Pas this is why! Passionate oh! indeed, baby! Oh, he goes down. Now on to Lapman. WQE, do it again! Gamsu <laughs> actually has to turn. The combo wasn't finished off on that time, and you can see just a few seconds what it means for Rise to have to turn around if that combo is not consecutively made out. He tries to keep it going, finally gets locked down again. It's one after the other of TDK getting themselves into that turret aggro and back out. That's going to be TDK picking up Woo. their second dragon. And the gold is pretty much evened up now, considering a lot of dam magic damage from the Zac. And there he goes on to Baby. Love what Dignitas is doing with their team here as well to deter them. And oh, there the he Talisman goes. of Ascension goes off. Only a Dark Binding. A Zingy flies over the wall. Kaz is going to be the first target they look at. Seraph's actually Gansu. diving into the crying out. Gansu, a little too far forward, takes the hits, but he's still alive. The Arcane Mastery and the Seraph's Embrace keep him alive. Kiwi Kid close to going down now as a Zingy flies through with Shifter's Soldiers, and they can only pick up a few more bits of DPS. It is going to be Baby going down by the hands of Kiwi Kid as they continue to fight a nice hail of arrows once again to keep Gamsu from getting back into this one. He's the so Talisman bad. of Ascension could be coming back up soon here. A Zingy maybe with a slingshot. Yeah, it's, it's up this already. This is an absolute coast-to-coast -coast fight again. right now. Talisman of Ascension once. A Zingy going for the slingshot. It's not going to be in range, and the fight is finally called off by Dignitas. He threw in the warp. That man! Like, oh. One more! Oh, so close! Ow! Oh. That was a lot of damage coming from Shifter Soldier right there. I wouldn't want to stand still either. It would put them in a bad situation or disadvantageous. And they come out. And Zingy, he's doing what you said. There goes the start. There's the strength. It's right on to Seraph. You cannot get away. Zingy has just turned it on here in the spring split for Dignitas. Making moves that are really paying off for the team. And now it's up to TDK to poke the hell out of Dignitas and get him off this Baron. Yeah, where was Baby before that? But look at this, Zingy's gonna go back in on the Baby. Bates call in, eyes on Bishu and Latman as well to make sure they stay safe. Baby throwing it back. Also uses the Mikhail's on himself to try and get out, but he gets taken down. Core JJ gets the rend off. Seraph's gonna be picking up third dragon here. Which is good, because it we is. just talked about movement speed. It it's going good. to get TDK, that but look at this. Oh, oh, Kaz oh, steals it. it! It's gonna be Kaz that takes down the Baron! Kiwi Kid's now getting hit, fake call, pulling back in. Seraph distracting the team on the other side, so Latman and Beast, you can get in with more poke, but they just want the Baron. They actually don't want the fight from what it looks like. Oh, a Zingy he... over the wall. Let's he got bounce. Stunned, though. He did get stunned. Oh, he's right back in. The beginning flies through, and a Zingy tries to keep it in the fight. He's going down. The blobs are out. The passive is down as well, and that's a 5v4 now for Team Dragon Knights. Gonna watch this go down Baron. if they can get a few more shots, and it will be. Baron ba wears off. Baron has worn off. TDK are able oh. to pressure through one more time. Gamsu getting the ultimate off. Does not take down Kaz. Still have some time to wait for him. Oh, he flashes over the chain of corruption. But Seraph goes in with the same idea. They are thinking alike right now. But Seraph oh. goes down first. That's the double kill for Gamsu. It's exactly what he wanted to be. Still going to go even in turret trades. And they're still going to get this inhibitor on top of everything. Gamsu with the balls to the wall play, flashing forward, knowing he had his arcane mastery close to up, plus the Saris embrace. But it's looking enough. They get this fourth dragon. Oh, let's bounce. Losses. Two members, almost three now. Kaz on the back line, very hurt. It's a nice cast, but it doesn't really separate the team in the way that he wanted. It's Dignitas with the ability to still put down the DPS. Core JJ over the wall now, doing what he can to take down Kaz, and they will back off once again, measured in their attack and not going too far. 
Also, they're very low, so they probably would have <laughs> died instantly going in there. So. No disrespect, just knowing that Kaz isn't there and there's not much you can do about it. Chain of Corruption comes out to stop Dignitas from moving off the Baron too fast. All the way over two gaps from the Baron pit. A Zingy hits up Seraph, but there's more members of Team Dignitas there, so his tenacity is through the roof right now and he breaks out immediately out of TDK yeah. nonetheless. So Latman goes top, they lose a good portion of their wave clear. And they lose Ooh. both turrets. This is all three inhibitors open. Okay, so as I say, they were taking all the inhibitor turrets. They start taking inhibitor turrets. A flash of Gamsu locks down Seraph. Still without too many members there, that risen, rune prison is going to do a good lockdown onto Aurelia. And they start to finish off the inhibitor turret now. Get more super minions down the mid lane here. Baron, remember, oh, is on to Dignitas. So the minions coming in are going to help even more. They already take down Baby. And it looks like Kiwi Kid once again forced out after his initial initiation. Shifter returning to the fight with a squad of super minions in the bottom lane. Or rather, minions that are barrened up. And they go for the fight. Whoa, Gamsu a little too far forward there. Puts himself in the fire and he gets burned real bad. But it's going to be the rest of the team. Shifter and Core JJ picking up kills and inhibitors for the team. As Dignitas finally looks to put, uh, looks like they're going to put a stamp on this game inside the base of TDK. And now some Nexus turrets. Dignitas, not with the same type of early game of pressure that we were no. expecting. Azingi, though, having another good performance on the Zac. He really I is. I am extremely surprised with how he's performing this season. It, yeah, in a way, if it's the thing that he can get the best engages on, like I said, the CLG Sejuani game he played wasn't that great. Maybe people will start banning out this Zac against Azingi since it's become yeah, it so down. good with the team. Maybe even it was Dignitas that started working better with it as he leveled up his play as well. It's just all come together for Dig. As you can see, four members down and Seraph almost on the fountain as he's quite dead. Team Dignitas are going to take down Team Dragon Knights.